This is Dr. Larry Stoll from Pace Turf. Uh, today I want to talk about uh, a condition that happens on, on greens during the winter and you'll see these light green patches that will show up uh, in irregular places and it seems to happen to all of the greens at the same time. Well we've, we've looked into this uh, quite carefully and there's no diseases associated with this phenomenon and what we're seeing on Poa annua greens is that there's some biotypes for example you can see this big patch uh, that, that are, are lighter green colored certain times of the year and it's either because they can't pick up nutrients or, or, or they're just not that naturally dark a color uh, and it shows up and separates during either the high temperature or low temperature periods. For example, take a look at the, this situation where you see a, a light patch and then if you look at the weather you'll see that the, the weather's within the normal range and then it dips down so it's, it gets way below normal conditions for it as are expected at this particular time. And that period of time stimulated these, this patch and a few other patch, patches to show up uh, at that time of year, which is indicative of a biotype or uh, a variety difference in the POA annual. And in any one green, there's about 26 different biotypes, which that can mean that they, they have different numbers of chromosomes even. Uh, and it could be in the sort of the reptans uh, variety of POA annual or the, uh, or the POA annual annual, the annual biotype of POA. So it's a a very highly variable uh, organism. And then, in, in, for example, take a look at this one. In this case, you can see the weather's going along and you, you watch the uh, normal high and low temperatures and then you get this spike up where the temperatures were too high and that resulted in the grass turning a, a little bit lighter green also. And the characteristics of these patterns that, that, that help you know whether it's a disease or not, it's that tight outline and jaggedy sort of look uh, around the edge of the, of the light green patch. So it's not uh, it's not a it's not a circular diffuse uh, growing ring. Uh, those patches will just stay that same shape uh, for for weeks at a time because it's actually individual plants are are lighter green colored uh, than the surrounding plants. So you can have it um, happen fairly commonly. Extreme temperatures, highs or lows, and uh, it shouldn't be too much of a surprise. And there isn't a way to really correct this. I mean, you can throw some more fertilizers on, but I think what tends to happen is that you make the the, the turf, the, the grasses around it that are able to pick up the nitrogen well, uh, those tend to get darker green. So it, it's not that the light green patch is getting lighter green, but the area around it's getting darker. So for management practices, it's just uh, uh, keep doing what you would normally do. I wouldn't get excited about it. Don't manage for the uh, for the small patches. Manage for the entire area, and just uh, wait a little while, and they'll start to get more uniform uh, color as the temperatures moderate, either uh, going into the spring or coming into the fall.